pro boxer Nong Rose doesn't back down from a fight. A transgender athlete with a crusading attitude, her victories in half of some 300 matches have won her acceptance and admiration in her home country of Thailand. Having a transgender like me fighting promotes the idea that people like us are not here to be looked down upon. It asks Thai society to accept us, since we don't experience much acceptance. We have to use our talents to show Thai people that transgender people have what it takes. This month, the 21-year-old is taking her talents abroad for a highly anticipated fight in Paris. It's a first for her, but also for France, where professional transgender athletes haven't yet been seen in the ring. For boxing fan and transgender athlete Christine, Nong Rose's story is an inspiration. I'm a trans woman and it was complicated because I was in the boys' category. I didn't want to dress like a boy and look like a boy competing with boys. It didn't appeal to me. It's not that I have anything against boxing boys, it's just my identity. I didn't want it to be misrepresented. While trans people fight to have their genders recognized in society at large, the world of competitive sports where gender categories determine opponents, presents a special challenge. For Nong Rose's adversary, her gender identity isn't something he takes into consideration. For me, I see a man in front of me. He has two arms, two legs, a head, like I do. People I know were a little surprised at first sight, but after they got it, they saw videos of him and they understood he's a real boxer. Nong Rose has plans to take her sexual transition farther, but only after the end of her career for fear hormone therapy could affect her performance. Until then, every fight under her belt is one closer to sending stereotypes out of the ring for good.